creating a new funnel by using the page editor. Hello there, good friends. FX Funnel is a powerful page builder that provides you with the right tools to help you set up pages for every step of the perfect marketing funnel. In this video, we're going to show you how to use these tools to create a complete funnel from scratch, easily, step by step. Start on the app's dashboard and click on the My Funnels tab to go to the Funnels page. Now, click on the New Funnel button. You will be asked to select the type of funnel that you want to build before you get started. The types of funnel that you can select include product launch, sales, emails, membership, webinar, and marketplace. For this example, we are going to select emails to create a funnel that will allow us to easily capture email leads. Next, you will be asked to enter a name for your funnel into the Funnel Title field and a custom subdomain for the funnel's landing page into the Custom Subdomain field. You can click on Next after you enter this information. Now it is time to start creating your funnel. As you can see here, a funnel is divided into steps. On each step, you will customize a page. The number of steps in the category of page on each step will depend on the type of funnel that you select to create. In this example, because we selected emails, our funnel is divided in two steps. The first step is an opt-in page to capture email leads. And the second step is a thank you page that you have to use to show a message or instructions to a lead after he submits the lead form. However, you can add additional steps and pages to a funnel by clicking on the Create New Step button. You just have to select a type of page for the new step in the funnel to enter the name of the new step into the Step Title field and to click on Add. Because we are not going to add a new step to this funnel, we'll simply click on Cancel. All right, let's continue. To customize a step, you simply have to make sure that the right step is selected on the steps column. You can rearrange the order of the steps by using the Move Up or Move Down buttons. Next, click on the Set Page button in the Create Page section. You will have the options to choose a page template, which is the regular way. But I would love to show you how to use our awesome page editor, so let's click on New from Scratch. This will open the FX Funnel Page Builder, a powerful built-in drag-and-drop page editor. With this editor, you'll simply have to select the device you'll design a funnel for, and then to start adding elements manually, no coding required. Okay, first, select Desktop if your funnel is for desktop users, or Mobile if your funnel is for mobile users. Next, start dragging the elements that you'll add to your page. There are two ways to do this with FX Funnel. If you are an experienced designer, you can click on the From Scratch tab to start by dragging design grids to the design layout. Next. All you have to do is to click on a grid to display the customization menu. This customization menu allows you to add text, media, lists, and buttons. You can also use this menu to stylize and clone your page elements. Now, if you don't want to customize every single element from scratch, you can simply click on the Templates tab to select and drag pre-made elements that you can customize on the fly. There are several types of elements that you can insert from this tab. Content allows you to insert a pre-made grid that includes a headline, a subheader, a copy placeholder, and an image placeholder. Image Block allows you to insert an image block where you can upload your own images. Download allows you to insert a customizable download button with a background and text. Video allows you to insert a customizable splash page with a video player. Emailing allows you to insert a neatly designed lead gen form to your layout. Slider allows you to transform your layout into a scrollable page. Stamps allows you to divide your layout into customizable text sections divided by different design elements. Text Grids allows you to insert customizable text grids into your layout. Benefits allow you to insert customizable text placements that help you highlight information about your offer. Portfolio allows you to insert different image grids into your layout to highlight product images. Testimonials allows you to insert customizable placements to highlight testimonials in your landing page. Team allows you to insert customizable grids to feature your staff or members of your team. Countdown allows you to insert countdown timers that increase urgency, some with customizable text and image. And lastly, navigation allows you to insert a navigation bar to the header of your layout. For this example, we're going to click on emailing to insert a minimalist, highly attractive lead gen form that we can customize with our headline, our description, and an image. To customize an element on the page, you'll simply have to click on it. For example, to customize this headline, we'll simply click on it to replace it with our own headline. 
You can further edit text by using the options available in the Element Properties window as well as on the formatting menu on top. Click on Save Changes after you make an edit. To customize the image, we'll simply click on the image and then we'll click on the Image tab. Now we'll click on Open Image Gallery. You can use images from this library or you can click on Upload Image to add an image from your computer. You can further edit an image by clicking on the Style tab. Remember to click on Save Changes after making an edit. Now we're done, so let's move to the next step. After you finish a page on the Builder, click on the Save button. You can click on the Preview button to preview your new page on a different tab, and you can click on Back to continue creating your funnel. You can create a variation of any page on your funnel by clicking on the Create Variation button in the Start Split Test section to test and optimize the optimal funnel design. Now it is time to set up the second step in this funnel. To customize a different step in your funnel, you'll simply have to click on the step below the step that you previously customized. The steps that follow are the same we applied when we customized the previous step, and they'll only differ in how you customize the page according to the type of page that you selected. So, we'll start by clicking on the Set Page button. Next, we'll click on New from Scratch. Now that the page builder is open, we're going to add the next step in our lead gen funnel. This is a thank you page. So we are going to insert a simple content grid to add a thank you message for the user, an additional description of the incentive that we'll send him to his email address, and an image related to our offer. Then we'll click on Save and then on Back to continue. After you complete customizing your funnel steps, click on the Settings tab to configure your funnel general settings. Here you can edit the funnel title and custom subdomain that you entered at the beginning. You can publish a funnel to the marketplace so it is recommended that you also add a description, a logo, a background image, and a fave icon. In the Marketplace Settings section, you can enter a funnel price, select the currency to get your payments, and a payment method. Additional settings that you can configure on this page are Autoresponder Integration, Payment Integration, Analytics Integration, Custom Domain, and Create Countdown. When you click on any of these icons, you'll be taken to the Integrations page where you have to select the correct integration and the funnel that you'll use. To publish your funnel to the marketplace, you'll simply have to click on the Publish in Market icon. Lastly, you can check the Leads tab after your funnel starts receiving activity to see how it performs. Here you can see total visits as well as total clicks. You can see the number of leads that have completed the funnel in opt-ins. You can click on Details to see leads by email list. And on Visits by Steps, you can see the number of visits and clicks that each step in your funnel is getting. This, my friends, is how you can create and manage a high converting funnel with FX Funnel. It doesn't get any better or easier than this.